1939, Geyer Springs Mission started on the corner of West 57th and Geyer Springs Road in a 20 by 12 milk barn that had a tin roof, some wooden benches, and a dirt floor. A year later, that mission was given a piece of land and a small white frame building was built and there with 37 charter members, Geyer Springs First Baptist Church was established. Through the years, the Lord led our congregation through several building programs and many ministry endeavors that have shaped our future. We grew in attendance, in impact to the community, and in vision to be a church that reaches the globe. In 1992, we felt the Lord lead us to begin a second location right here on Interstate 30. We were one church in two locations. Then in 1997, the Lord led us to relocate all of our ministry to our I-30 campus. We completed this worship center in 1998. Almost 25 years later, Geyer Springs stands on a legacy of faith that has given us a bright future. We're a church that loves people of every age and in every stage of life. We've made it a priority to shape the next generation with God's word and to put them on mission with the gospel of Jesus Christ. We desire to see families experience spiritual growth and life change and to live their lives to honor God. Geyer Springs Baptist Church exists to glorify God by making disciples who love God and love others. I believe our mission is fulfilled as we worship the Lord together, connect in biblical community, serve others with our time and talents, and multiply disciples. As I think about the legacy of the past and pray for God's vision for the future, I think of those who took a great step of faith to found this great church. Just as God directed the next steps of those 37 charter members in 1940, we are also called to trust Him with our next steps. The Geyer Springs family has been faithful generation after generation to seek the Lord, obey His word, and take a next step of faith. And that is exactly what I believe God continues to call us to do. This is why we've decided to launch a brand new generosity initiative called Next Steps. Our walk with Christ wasn't meant to be stagnant, but always meant to be active, to move forward. God is calling us to greater things, to greater impact, and to a greater vision. I believe that God has a great desire to use Geyer Springs in ways we've never experienced. I don't want us to miss out on what God has for us. Proverbs 16.9 tells us we can make our plans, but the Lord determines our steps. I don't want to lead our church to do what we can do, but only what He can do. The Lord has a purpose and plan for you, for us. Let's answer His call, fulfill our purpose, and step out in faith by praying and obeying His next steps for us. The Next Steps initiative will change the way we give and the way we fund our ministries. In the past, you could give to our general budget, our mission offering, or our building fund. In an effort to streamline our giving and strengthen our vision, we want to pull all of our giving streams into one fund, which will be the vehicle we use to resource all of our ministries, our missions, and our building improvements. Over the next two years, we desire to fund three targets. The first of these targets is our church. This represents the funding necessary to provide for our week-to-week -week operations, which includes salaries for our employees, utilities, maintenance, as well as program funding for our media and worship ministries and discipleship ministries. We want the next generation to know the Word, come to Christ, and to serve His church for generations to come. So, with this funding, we will continue to disciple preschool, children, and students with weekly ministries and annual events. We will also continue to serve adults and families with Sunday school classes, men's and ladies Bible studies, chapel services, conferences, and other events. To meet the needs of our church over the next two years, we are seeking to raise $7.7 .7 million. The next target is our mission. This represents the resources that provide for all of our mission endeavors, including our support for the North American Mission Board, the International Mission Board, our state convention ministries, and the Arkansas Baptist Children and Family Ministries. We will fund our community missions, upward sports, local, national, international mission trips, our missions office staff, Feed the Need, Meet the Need, The Joy Project, and 15 mission partnerships we have with church planters and mission agencies. We would also like to raise an additional $1 million over the next two years to fund three additional mission endeavors, ministry to single moms, 
increased ministry to those struggling with addiction, and a church planting residency for training pastors who will help us start new churches in Central Arkansas. To meet the needs of our mission, over the next two years, we are seeking to raise $3.3 million. Our last target is our future. I believe that God has given us a significant vision to spend time and focus outside these walls, but we still have an important responsibility to be stewards over what God has already given us. We moved into our worship center nearly 25 years ago. During that time, we have done very little to maintain and upgrade our worship center. It's time we address issues like carpet and paint and new seating. This past year, we've had to address the upheaval of the slab in our children's lobby due to moisture in the soil. That movement of the slab also affected the stage in the worship center. Although the stage is structurally safe, it's no longer level and will need to be removed and rebuilt. In addition to the worship center, we'd like to refresh our main lobby to match the work that we're doing in the worship center. And we want to address those steep lobby stairs that are no longer up to code and are a safety concern for young families and senior adults. Included in the worship center remodel will be the three sets of bathrooms around our worship center. We also plan to update our preschool check-in area and the hallways throughout our preschool center so that we can continue to serve our young families with excellence. We're still getting numbers and trying to understand the cost of this target, but we believe it will be somewhere in the range of five to six million dollars. Now, you've probably been adding along with me, so let me clarify. If we didn't do anything differently, we would typically expect to receive approximately $10 million over the next two years based on our current giving. That number is included in the Next Steps initiative. Next Steps will add an additional six to seven million dollars for a total of 16 to 17 million dollars over the next two years. Wow, that is something only God can do. And we believe he will as every individual, every family, every one of us considers our next step in generosity. In reality, the win here isn't a number, it's not a building, it's not even more ministry. The win for our church family is to have 100% engagement in this initiative. Every single one of us turning our hearts toward the Lord, seeking, praying, and obeying. 100% of us asking the Lord, what is the next step you would have me take in generously supporting the ministry you've entrusted to us as your church. Luann and I are all in. Will you join us on this journey? Let's discover together what happens when we, full of faith, seek the Lord and ask Him to direct our next steps. Where will God lead and what will He do for our church, for our mission, for our future? I, for one, can't wait to experience God's presence as we respond in worship, respond in faith, and respond in sacrifice. Let's do this, Geyer Springs. Let's take our next steps.